just unplug my cables, unplug my battery, this is a recipe for disaster given the wet environment that I live in. Check out the bottom of my kayak. Nothing but water. How to fix that this week on Kayak Hack. Welcome back. If you're new to the channel, we cover kayak modifications, spin, and fly fishing. So poke that subscribe button so you don't miss anything. Now, let's get on with it. So I don't know about everybody else, but you can see from that little brief clip, my kayak ends up being one wet mess when I'm done using it. And in this humid North Carolina weather, the humidity just lasts and lasts. Look at the top of the toolbox that I keep my GoPro stuff in here. You see nothing but moisture and everything collecting on it. My kayak is still wet and it's been a day. So what I worry about is that all these expensive electrical cables will become rusty, corroded, or get stuff on the inside of them that will make them unusable. So here's what I do to solve that problem. Using a pillbox with a flip top, mark what you need for space, and now just use this to put the cables in. The last step is to put one of these silica gel packets in the bottom of the pill bottle because that will take out some of the moisture. You'll need to replace these periodically because this isn't totally airtight. And now when I'm done fishing, just a matter of taking all these connectors that I don't want to get rusty and corroded, sticking them in the pill bottle, and then snapping it shut. Now everything's protected from splash, humidity, and all the other problems that can occur with electrical connectors. Once everything is in the pill bottle, I know I can just leave it in the bottom of my kayak and everything's gonna be okay. The link to where you can get those silica packets is in the description below. Comments? Anybody have a better way of making sure your expensive cables don't get ruined? Let me know in the comments. Take care.